The Public Curator's Office is one of the division under the Department of Justice and Attorney General, but it is a government division in need. Today, it launched its new office location in Kokopo, one of the positive moves taken by the public curators in recent times. It seeks to make its presence felt in the New Guinea Islands region, but its roles and responsibilities hasn't got the recognition it deserved over the years since its first establishment. In this interview, Jacob Popuna, the public curator, raised concerns on the state and the general operation of the curator's office in Papua New Guinea. The structure is in place, everything is in, in place to run. We need uh, logic support. That is our uh, problem, hindrance at the moment. Many may not see the work of public curators as significant as any other government divisions, but it plays an important role. It assists resolve issues involving benefits and assets and how it will be shared amongst family members of a deceased person. But lack of financial support has contributed to unresolved issues such as land titles and property ownership. I think our biggest concern is our ability to effectively provide this is estate management, uh, service management to our people. Um, we are still struggling to provide an effective service when it comes to disease estate management. Living issues unresolved may result to forfeiting of personal assets to the state or banks, leaving the next of kin with nothing from their family lineage, and that is a serious problem for Papua New Guineans, such as land titles and property ownerships, where they considered as birthrights. Edwin Fidelis, National MTV News, Kokopo.